Throughout the Mid-Atlantic, trees are central to our quality of life. They soften our landscape each spring, offer welcome shade from summer heat, glorious colors each fall, and buffer cold winter winds. They provide clean air to breathe, home for birds and other wildlife, and can add value to our homes. But electricity is also an integral part of life. As your electric cooperative, we work hard to provide reliable service. Sometimes we need your help to accomplish this goal. A leading cause of power outages is falling trees and limbs that come in contact with overhead power lines disrupting service. These outages are inconvenient for many and can be life-threatening for some. They can cause failure of life support systems, traffic signals, and home alarms and disrupt operations at hospitals and businesses. Just one tree in the wrong place left unmanaged can affect a large number of people. As your electric provider, we work hard to maintain utility rights of way, since power restoration takes longer in areas where the right of way is overgrown. Your electric cooperative clears trees and other vegetation adjacent to power lines on a rotating schedule based on a number of years. Your cooperative may also use an approved herbicide to eliminate fast-growing trees while still allowing ground cover to spread. Spraying reduces costs for cooperative members and makes it easier for utility vehicles to access right-of-way for maintenance and repairs. Be aware of any power corridor easements near where you live, both overhead and underground, and contact your co-op if you have any questions about what should and should not be planted in these areas. Contact your electric provider if you're concerned about a tree growing too close to the right-of-way. Rather than attempt to clear overhead trees and limbs near rights of way yourself, leave it to the skilled experts at your co-op. Plan ahead and take these three steps before planting near power lines. First, do your homework. Know the mature height and width of the tree and its growth rate. Second, know how far away from overhead lines to plant. Trees that will reach 40 feet or more should be planted at least 60 feet away from the center of the right-of-way. Trees up to 40 feet in height should be planted at least 40 feet away from power lines. Call Miss Utility at 811. Allow enough time for utility workers to mark lines before undertaking any project requiring digging. Avoid planting bushes and shrubs near transformer boxes since these plants may hinder co-op workers who need to access them for maintenance. As cooperative members and good stewards of our environment, it's in all our best interests for electric utilities to maintain rights of way. Together we can avoid some of the costs involved with power restoration and storm cleanup, helping to save you money while keeping your lights on. It's a win-win for both co-ops and our members.